whatever you ask me actually he said whatever you want and you ask me I will give it to you so many times we take the scripture we're like hey man I want me a Lamborghini you know I want me that girl God she's my wife you know I want me a nice house I want me a good looking body and we begin to fantasize and go beyond Disney World dreams and we begin to throw it on the scriptures name it claim it bless it possess it and we just begin to take it in says this has to work and we pray once we pray second time we pray third time and it's not working you have to understand that Jesus gives this promise to those who have submitted to the purpose of the branch in other words he's saying I will answer your call if you answer mine my call for your life is to see people saved my call for your life is to see people changed I'm calling you imagine you get a phone call and sometimes you're busy doing something else and you ignore the call so this is God calling you saying today if you're a Christian if you're not a believer today you can just kind of sit back and just listen to the Christians once you become a Christian tonight you this can apply to you too but just gonna sit there let me just gonna talk to us for a moment you have a free pass if you're a Christian God is calling you not to just to Africa India or Mexico he is calling you sometimes across the room across the street across the bedroom to another person in your own house who is your sister or your brother and he says I want you to be my branch I want you to live for the purposes I lived on this earth when we pick up the call when we answer the call he says now when you call me I'm gonna answer also because you answered my call many times people don't understand the difference between the career and calling see a career is something you choose in school calling is something God chose on a cross the moment Jesus came and died on this world for sins of people your calling was already chosen people sometimes wait they're like I just want to know my calling and they spent 15 years I just want to know my calling what many people are actually wanting to know is their career and about career God says whatever you want to do, do as long as it's not you know smoking pot or selling pot or doing some other illegal and sinful things as long as it makes you money and brings people happiness and makes you feel good do it but that's your career your calling you don't choose your calling that's chosen for you how is that chosen the vine the calling for the vine was chosen by the farmer and the calling of the branch was chosen by the vine your calling was chosen by Jesus Christ your career is chosen by your personality your desires and your wishes your career is what you can change you don't like being an accountant you can become an owner of the company if you don't like working at that job you can switch jobs and you don't have to go to a profit and fast for five days is it the will of God for me to move from management to the upper management if you like it do it your career can change your calling never changes whether you become a CEO or homeless it's still the same whether you're healthy or sick it's still the same our callings never change whether we are preacher a home group leader or tomorrow you relocate to another church and you go to that church and maybe the focus is not on souls your calling does not change with territory it does not change with a nationality group it does not change with weather if the government tells us you can't preach about Jesus our calling does not change on our government it changes by God and God says it won't change until he brings everyone to salvation can somebody say amen that's why when my pastor moved to Tri-Cities that's why when our pastor moved to Tri-Cities this was a different language this was a different culture people said well you already did over there now you just can relax in Tri-Cities but my pastor said see my career can change in Tri-Cities but my calling cannot change I have to learn the English I have to find a way I have to raise another generation I have to find a building why because once God calls you he does not change that that stays with you for the rest of your life can somebody say amen a career is what gives you money your calling is what gives you purpose it's what gives you fulfillment it's what gives you miracles 
It's what takes you to another level with God. If you answer his call, he wants to pick up yours.